Good morning and a very warm welcome to all of you to CHIJ Katong Convent. I am Mrs. Hilda Tong, the principal, and it is my pleasure to share with you about Casey today. Let me start with what is unique about Casey. Katong Convent is a Catholic mission school. In fact, we are one of the 11 Infant Jesus schools in Singapore. Since 2003, we have been accorded the autonomous status by Ministry of Education, which means that while we follow the national syllabus, we are given autonomy and additional funding to offer a special range of programs to enhance our students' learning experience and develop their talents. We are affiliated with CHIJ Katong Primary and Catholic Junior College. To get here, there are many bus services you can take, and by 2024, it will be even easier to reach us via the Thompson East Coast Line with the Marine Terrace MRT station right at our doorstep. As a CHIJ school, our mission is to be a Christ-centered community where all work together for the promotion of truth, justice, freedom and love with special reference to the needs of persons who are disadvantaged in any way. Our IJ motto is simple in virtue, steadfast in duty. We continue to be guided by our founder, Blessed Nicholas Barre's philosophy that every child is unique and is blessed with God-given talents. We can nurture each child to realize her talents to the fullest and we can develop each child's sense of duty and responsibility to the community. In Katong Convent, our vision is a caring school that excels. We place emphasis on developing in students the values of perseverance, integrity, excellence and respect. We prepare our students to be ready for the future by nurturing them to become effective communicators compassionate servant leaders, innovative problem solvers, and discerning citizens of the world. As a caring school, we aspire to care for our students, appreciating their unique talents, backgrounds, and personalities, and bringing out the best in them. We also care for our staff by affirming their strengths, developing their capabilities, and looking after their well-being. We are also committed to care for the environment, including conserving resources and using school spaces responsibly. Over 92 years, we have built a culture of care and excellence, where we seek to improve continuously and cultivate a growth mindset in all our members in order to bring out the best in every individual to bring out the best in others. We love all our girls. They are really our pride and joy. We support them to achieve personal excellence by focusing on four areas of development. Strengthening student wellness, building strength of character, achieving academic excellence, and enhancing communicative, performing and visual arts edge. We develop the students holistically through a wide range of rich programs which we will highlight in the coming slides. In KC, we plan our programs using our eCube approach to develop students' talents. At the experience level, we provide quality experience for all students. At the enriched level, we deepen the learning for identified segments of the student population. And at the extend level, we stretch talented or high progress learners by providing them with challenging opportunities. I will now move on to share with you what is exciting at KC. Let's start with the distinctive programs in each of the four areas of development. To bring about student wellness, our dedicated teachers take time to know and build rapport with every child. We teach our students to have growth mindset that all of them are talented and can excel. Through level camps, they learn to bond and work with classmates. They are also taught to provide 
peer support for one another. And to build strength of character, we provide our unique character and citizenship education and religious education, developing in our girls' values, social-emotional competencies and spirituality perspectives. And through our IJ Heritage Programme, they learn to appreciate and to be inspired by the IJ history, identity and their predecessors in the IJ family. True to our IJ mission, our girls carry out Values in Action projects to serve the community. And to help them discern their strengths and possible vocations, they go through a comprehensive education and career guidance program. In KC, there is a place for every girl. We believe that every girl can be a student leader who is values driven and who is committed to influence and make a positive impact on the lives of others. Training opportunities are provided for every student before they take on various leadership roles. At the enriched level, they can decide on a specialized area they want to serve further in, be it the CCA leaders, class leaders or student council. And the top leaders from each of these groups form the Student Leadership Board at the extent level, who collaborate closely with the school management to bring about improvements in the school. Let's move on now to the area of academic excellence. KC is already into its second year of the Personalized Digital Learning Program this year, where every girl owns a personal learning device. To engage students effectively in learning, we have our unique Dibble approach to lesson design, which will be elaborated in the next slide. Fortnightly, we hold our Independent Learning Day, where students carry out home-based learning and student-initiated learning. Learning in KC is enriched by integrating application to real-world contexts and field trips and learning journeys. Our mother tongue language fortnight heightens students' interest in the subjects. The arts and drama programs will be featured in the upcoming CPVA segment. Our unique Dibble approach stands for differentiated instruction, blended learning and e-pedagogy. This is an example of a Dibble infused lesson unit on the graphs of quadratic functions. Students are given a pre-lesson task to identify their readiness level and grouped according to the level. The SLS lesson and their worksheets are customized and differentiated according to their readiness groups. Through this lesson experience, students learn at their own pace, tapping on the GeoGebra application to aid their mastery of the concept as they work collaboratively with their peers to acquire the knowledge and skills. Every department provides a rich learning experience for all students using the eCube approach. For example, beyond the curriculum, the science department enriches students' learning through fun activities which allow them to apply their learning, such as soap making and perfume making. For very talented or high progress learners, their experiences are further extended by competition opportunities, such as the Singapore Junior Chemistry Biology Olympiad, A-Star Science Award and Research Exposure Program, International Biomedical Quiz, Ignite Skills Challenge, just to name a few. In KC, the communicative, performing and visual arts is our school niche. We believe that the arts are integral to a life lived fully and meaningfully. Hence, we provide opportunities for the creation, appreciation or leadership of the arts as a key aspect of KC's holistic education, so that all students may experience the arts even as we hone the talents and interests of our budding artists. Arts experiences that all our students take part in include exciting arts assembly programs and our Book and Music Week, which is an arts festival that we have been celebrating for over 40 years since the 1970s. I will now share with you the various programs we have for each of our art forms. Since the 1970s, KC has been known for choral speaking and creative writing 
and we have continued this strength to develop all our girls into confident and articulate speakers. Students who are passionate about strengthening their speaking or writing skills can join our open mic or writer's lab workshops, where we invite professional artists to share different speaking and writing techniques. Passionate students can extend their craft by offering full literature at either O or N levels, especially since we are a school who has continued to not only offer the Shakespearean text to all our students, but to also offer N level literature. We provide opportunities for our students to further their communicative writing practice by taking part in the T-Works 24-hour playwriting of which many have emerged winners over the years. We offer many performing arts CCAs, but we also offer drama as a subject in our lower secondary express and NA courses. Students not enrolled in a performing arts CCA have opportunities to perform during our book and music week or our arts immersion program. Passionate students with a talent for the dramatic arts may also choose to offer it as an O-level subject. Not only are we one of the pioneer schools, but we are also one of only six schools in Singapore to offer the subject. We also have the Mentorship and Development in Drama program for our DSA drama students to nurture their leadership and strength in the dramatic arts. The Performing Arts DSA students are also given opportunities to design arts immersion programs for their peers. KC is also a school which nurtures interest in the visual arts. We are one of only nine schools in Singapore which offers the Enhanced Art Programme, specially funded by MOE. Just last year, we celebrated our 10th anniversary with an online art exhibition of our student work, which you may view on our school website. All students study the visual arts in lower secondary, and those who wish to further explore visual arts can do so during our Arts Immersion Programme, where they learn silk screen printing, 3D modelling, and even how to manipulate makeup. At upper secondary, students may offer art at the O or N levels where they can pursue a visual art form of their interest, study under local artists, and attend master classes. DSA visual arts students are also enrolled in DIVA, our development initiative for visual arts, which hones their craft and arts leadership. Our KC Arts and Culture is a specialised leadership programme for students who are passionate about the arts and wish to serve as advocates and leaders of the arts in KC. They share their interests and talents with others, such as by organising internal and external arts festivals for the school and community. Just last year, they ran Food Generation, a hybrid hawker food art trail at Marine Terrace where students recreated hawker food to look like fine dining. Next, let's look at the CCAs at KC. In KC, every student is involved in one core CCA. Secondary school students are encouraged to learn and grow deeply in the CCA that they are involved in. CCAs take place in the afternoons on Wednesdays and Fridays. Most are held in school, while some, such as canoeing, bowling and track and field, are held at external venues. The E-Cube approach is also applied in CCAs. For instance, in a concert band, for experience, all students learn proper etiquette while attending public concerts. They are exposed to different instruments and given a chance to perform at school concerts. To enrich their learning, some students participate in the Singapore Youth Festival Arts Presentation or perform at solo recitals and ensemble concerts. Our band has performed at Limelight in Esplanade Concert Hall, Victoria Concert Hall and most recently at the Istana. We also bring them to watch concerts by professionals such as the Singapore Symphony Orchestra to deepen their appreciation of music. And at the extent level, a segment of the concert band students also take the ABRSM music exams, 
perform at national competitions, and even go for overseas performances. You can see the wide range of CCAs we offer in the performing arts, sports, uniformed groups, and clubs and societies. To meet the needs of students, we spend time to know their interests and talents before matching them to the most suitable CCA of their choice. We will now explain the admission requirements to KC. The PSLE scores for admission to KC are shown on this slide for the three streams. Although students are admitted according to streams, next year we will start to implement full subject-based spending, which means that the SEC1 classes will have a mix of streams. Please take note of these important dates. After the release of the PSLE results, you will be given seven calendar days to choose your child's preferred secondary schools. Thereafter, the school posting results will be released in December, just before Christmas. So, we encourage you to join our KC family, where every girl is developed holistically to shine with her God-given talents. Thank you and see you in KC in 2023.